Hey guys, good morning. So I realized, I don't know how well you can see me now, probably better than how the lighting was last night in the kitchen, but uh, I realized when I was uploading that video, when I was looking at the footage, that you can't even see my eye when I was asking you how my eye looks. It was just all like in shade and stuff, so you couldn't see it. I don't know if you can see it now, but it feels a little better this morning. I can tell that I did something to it. Like I woke up at first and like it was just kind of like thinking my eyes were sleepy and then I'm like, Oh yeah, I poked my eye last night with a corner of a bag. Anyway, so I think it's fine. I don't like. I didn't, I didn't think it would swell because it's usually like if you hit around where your eyeball is, that's what it swells. Uh, but it's it was the actual eyeball that I hit, and I can see fine and stuff. It still just like feels kind of groggy. Um, but everything else is fine. Gwen is awake. She just had some breakfast. I haven't heard Annika yet, so I guess, she, I guess she's sleeping in. It's, oh, it's 8.59, it's almost 9 o'clock. I actually woke up a little later today. Not because of my eye, but because of, uh, I was up last night. I played Harvest Moon for a while, and then um, I uploaded the video from yesterday, the Annika's birthday vlog, and then... Um, I watched an episode of This Is Us and then played Harvest Mutant <laughs> some more. So um, I was going to watch a couple episodes, but anyway, so I, I was up late. It was like one something, I think. Um, oh, and then I shaved my legs. So yeah, it was I was up for a while. And then I played a little bit of solitaire in bed. But uh, yeah, so I woke up at 7.30 when my alarm went off this morning and... Uh, I was like, mm, I just really don't want to get up yet. So long story short, I woke up at like 8.04 and I'm like, oh, I guess I should probably get up now. And so I got Gwen out of bed. She was awake. I got her out of bed. She had, she just had breakfast and we're just going to hang out for, for a little bit, wait for Annika to wake up. Um, and if she doesn't wake up by like 9.30, I might go check on her. But yeah, <laughs> my eye is good. Gwen's awake. I'm awake and I will see you in a few. Over here playing, Gwen's got, or Annika's got the little dollhouse. She's got dog. <laughs> she was barking. By the way, um, good job. <laughs> Carly is trying to rub on me. There you go. Lay down. I'm not being super rough with him, by the way. I'm not like kicking him hard. I don't know if it looks like I am, but I'm just pushing him enough to, <laughs> to knock him over so that he won't rub on me. Oh, Annie sees a kitty. <laughs> kitty! What is that kitty doing? Be nice, Annie. Nice touches. <laughs> She's like, I get you with the dog. Rawr! Um, so, it's not the first thing I was going to talk about, but I wanted to tell you, um, and it doesn't count until, and I thought about uh, trying to ask her again and, and recording it, or trying to record it, um, and, but it does, so it doesn't really count if I can't, sh if I'm not showing you. And he is so excited about the cat. <laughs> it doesn't count if I'm not showing you. But Gwen, I don't know what the best. Here, let's see if I can. It's really not super dark in here, but it probably seems dark with this. There, is that better? Um, That's probably a little bit better light. <laughs> we have that lamp over there. It's not super stable, but it adds extra light. Kelly, stop. <laughs> Beat this cat. Trying to talk to you and getting distracted. Um, so, yeah, I, um, before Annika woke up, I had Gwen up, and Gwen was sitting on my lap. And um, we didn't have anything, like any kind of music or video or anything, TV, anything going on. It was just quiet, and it was me and Gwen. Ooh. Gwen had had breakfast. And I decided to see if she knew any of the animal noises. Um, I think it started because I like said something and she like made the noise and I was like, let's see. So then I did like, I did dog, cat, monkey, lion, and bear, which is like the same noise. Oh, my phone, I think she just knocked my phone down. I was like, what just happened? What just got knocked down? Um, yeah, dog, cat, lion, bear, monkey, uh, sheep, horse, cow, um, <laughs> Moo? Are you mo are you mooing like a cow? Um, I think that was it. I feel like there might have been another one, but at least those. And then I said pig and 
maybe, maybe not a pig, but all those noises that I mentioned, all those animals, the noises that, that they make, sheep, oh, and duck, I think that was the only other one, um, sheep, I don't know if I said sheep, she made all those noises when I, when I was like, what does the cow say, or like whatever, whatever animal it was, and she did all the noises, it was really exciting, she may, I wasn't really sure about pig, if it was right or not, she made some kind of noise, but I don't know if she was like saying oink, 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 like trying to say oink, oink, or not, but it was really cool, like, she said some of those noises before, on and off, um, she definitely will say dog and duck, um, do like the wolf and the quack noises, um, and some others here and there, but it was really exciting to like, say each of the animals and she would say the noises, like, that's really exciting. Like, in most situations, if you try to have her, like, I don't know, if she <laughs> feels like she's in pressure or whatever, then like, she's not gonna want to do it, but it's good to know that she does know them. That, that was really exciting to, that she was able to do all of them. She may have had to like stop and think for a minute, but she was able to do all of them, so that was cool. Hey Gwen, what does a dog say? <laughs> Good job. What does a cat say? What does a cat say? Does it say meow? What does a monkey say? Good job. Ooh, ooh, ah, ah. What does a cow say? Good job, Eddie. What does a cow say, Gwen? What does a cow say? Mm. Good job. Moo. What does a horse say? No. No. <laughs> Good job. What does a sheep say? What does a sheep say? <laughs> Good job, Baba. What does a duck say? Good job. What does a lion say? Good job. What does a pig say? <coughs> oink, oink. <laughs> Good job. Yay, Gwen. It's really messy. I know it'll be messy, but we'll try it. So I made her a thing of oatmeal and uh, tried to feed her it. She w didn't really want to eat, like didn't really want me to feed her, but she wasn't trying to grab it. So then I put it back down and tried to have her feed it, her like feed herself like with the spoon and she didn't really want to do that and then she just stuck her hand in it and moved her hand all around and then just kind of like flung her hand out and I'm like yeah this is this is not happening so so then I I just uh, took the bowl put it in the kitchen cleaned off her hand dumped all of the oatmeal I had made which was like was enough for her it wasn't like a huge thing of oatmeal that I made but all the the whole bowl I just dumped in the trash and made her some toast so that's what happened. I didn't yell or anything, but I was, and I wasn't like banging stuff around, but I was not happy. <laughs> I was annoyed. So that happened. I don't know if she's tired. Are you sleepy, Any? Gwen's coming over. It reminds me of a time, it was a little different, but it reminds me of a time that I was at my friend Megan's house growing up. And every now and then I think of this time and different things remind me of it. But um, it was me and some other girls that were at, uh, Megan's house. Um, we had stayed the night. We were having breakfast, having some cereal, and one of the girls, I don't remember what we were eating. We were eating some kind of like probably colored cereal, um, like blue or something. I don't know. Maybe it was Captain Crunch, like the berries. I don't know. But we were eating some kind of cereal that was like colored. And, <coughs> and, and one of the girls mentioned that the milk looked blue. <laughs> and I was like, uh, that look, that's weird that the milk's blue. I don't think I want to drink that. I don't think I want to eat that. And so then a lot of the other girls were like, or some of the other girls were like, oh yeah, it is blue. And and uh, it kind of made me like second guess, like, is it supposed to be blue? Is it is it like, what's going on? And Megan was trying to tell us like, it's just the cereal. Like it's not a big deal. It's it's just blue because of the cereal. It's just like off color because of the cereal. It's There's nothing wrong with it. We can still eat it. But, but then we all, from that one girl, I don't remember who all was there or who the girl that originally mentioned it was, 
but we all just kind of had it in our heads at that point that there was something wrong with the milk because it was blue. So none of us ate the rest of our cereal at that point and we all like ended up dumping it out. And Megan wasn't super happy because she knew <laughs> she was the only rational thinker at the time and knew that there was nothing wrong with it and we were all wasting all the cereal that, that they had. Um, and I did feel bad dumping out my cereal, but at the same time I was like, there could be something wrong with it. <laughs> it kind of messed with my brain. But anyway, it made, dumping out Annika's, all of Annika's oatmeal made me think of that. So anyway, I wanted to tell you that. <laughs> having lunch she just woke up I played uh, harvest moon for a little bit for like two days worth of harvest moon <laughs> num, num, num. I love you. she's having some green beans and some oranges and then there's half a piece of bread under here and some turkey a piece of turkey which makes me want a turkey sandwich so I might end up I wasn't gonna have lunch but I might have a turkey sandwich that might happen Yummy bread. But what I want to tell you about. Oh, and it scared me. <laughs> Maybe I just need to add water, but Annie's green beans are half to mostly cold. They were in the fridge, but I tried to heat them up, and I only put them in the microwave for five seconds. I put the timer on five seconds. <sighs> I stopped it with one second left, so like they'd only been there four minutes. I stopped it with one second left because I heard some sparking and then a big flame <laughs> in the microwave. And everything's fine, like there's no uh, sign that there had been any kind of fire in there. And it was only for a second, but that was enough. <laughs> Super spooky. Um, yeah, so I don't know if I just need to wa add water, but I was like, okay, I'll just give it to her cold because it scared me but she's having some lunch Gwen's finishing her nap yummy you've eaten some turkey I think you dropped some but I don't know where it went oh there it is turkey yummy turkey I might make myself a turkey sandwich that sounds pretty good yummy <laughs> just wanted to tell you about that the microwave had a small fire for a second it was very scary.